Hi, how's it going? So, who has heard of Publish Subscribe before? Who has heard of Publish Subscribe? Who knows what the pattern is? And no one's heard of it. Okay. So, um, a really good example of Publish Subscribe is Twitter. Um, the idea is it's, it's, it's a pattern of communication for your applications um, so that you can decouple the producers of information and the consumers of information. Um, so like on Twitter, you would, you would have, um, you know, someone in Japan would get online and publish or, or tweet something with a certain hashtag, and then two days later you might get it in your feed because you've subscribed to that hashtag. And neither of you have to be on, online at the same time, which is really nice. Um, so I wrote a library on top of RethinkDB's change feeds uh, called RepubSub. And it makes it really easy to do um, publish subscribe um, in your Python, Ruby, or JavaScript applications, because I wrote a version of it for all three languages. So the idea is that uh, you have an exchange, a central exchange, which in this case is RethinkDB, and you have um, topics which you publish on, and then subscribers create queues which um, queue up messages that are coming in on those topics. Uh, the, on the topics that you're interested in. Slava kind of, Slava more than touched on it, uh, but change feeds are a feature of RethinkDB that allow you to do real-time notifications on changes on tables. So in this case, um, the exchange for the publish subscribe would be a table on RethinkDB, and whenever we create a topic, it's basically the key of that document is the topic, and that generates a new change that comes out on that table. Um, okay, so I'm now going to do the demo. Okay, so we've got, uh, this example is, it's like the Daily Planet and it's events that are happening and, they, and uh, related to superheroes. So there's a news feed and each, each news feed has some amount of uh, hashtags on it. So like here we've got Batgirl and Doctor Doom or in an interdimensional sludge match, you know. Um, lots of different stuff like that. Oops, up, let me talk. We can subscribe to, let's say we subscribe to all um, fights. Okay, so we got a fight with Dr. Doom and the Green Goblin and some other stuff. All right, so that's those fights. And we could subscribe to more than one if we want to. So let's say we want to subscribe to Batman and let's say a sidekick. Oops. Subscribe. Okay, so this is going to be really slow because it's just randomly generating stuff. So let me do this this one a little faster. Well, anyway, the uh, basic idea is that you can subscribe to hashtags. So, <laughs> <laughs> hey, who knows what that looks like? Um, okay, so let me go back to the talk here and see if I can. Maybe by the time I'm done with the talk, Batman will have a sidekick. So the idea is that the libraries are really easy to use. Um, here we just create an exchange. Uh, we call it comic book tags. Um, this is any of your connection information for your RethinkDB and this uh, for your RethinkDB database. And this is this ends up becoming a table, but you don't have to actually worry about that if you don't want to. Uh, and then we create a topic. Um, since RethinkDB is arbitrary JSON documents, your topic can be any JSON document you want. In this case, we're just going to make a list of strings. Um, and then uh, we take the topic and publish on it. Batman and Joker destroy downtown. Okay. So subscribing is pretty much just as easy. Um, you create an exchange. And then you create a requal filter. So this is, this is a requal function. Um, and you're allowed to, uh, in requal you can use lambdas or um, functions to filter um, documents. So in this case we just say that the topic has to contain Batman and fights. And then, um, then we create a queue, and that basically is, is kind of what Slava was showing earlier with the change feed. It sits there and waits for um, messages about Batman and fights to show up, and then allows you to um, listen on. Uh, so in this case, we, what we do is we do queue.subscription and print out any tags and news. So this one would be the topic would come through, and then this would be the body, and we print it out. So that's 
the basic idea of the library. Um, if you want full details, I wrote a full article on it. Uh, it's at rethinkdb.com slash docs slash publish subscribe. And also you can get the code on GitHub um, if anyone's interested.